Previously on Welcome to the Family. We completed our first short film. I guess maybe copyright laws were being infringed there. So we dissected the rules. We're in again. Not at liberty to say right now. No feedback whatsoever. I like when people communicate. So we are going to the ceremony totally blind. This is basically our last award. Anyone can entertain you, but only we edutain you. With a mixture of fun, learning, and craziness, my team and I travel the world motivating and connecting with people. Are you ready? Welcome to the family. My primary role is to work with businesses, usually within this market, the Tri-County area. So we got this really cool phone call from Ben, the business developer manager for the Dolphins. And provide them with a customized solution that can help them either grow their business or retain their current business or incentivize their employees. And he called because he wanted to do an event for his VIPs. We actually just started a nonprofit because one of the things we do to give back is we speak to children around the world. We go on these tours into other countries. We went for a couple of weeks to Belize this year and we spoke to over 10,000 kids. Nice. I think that uh, we'll have quite a bit to talk about then on Thursday. You know, put together like a, a really nice experience for the group that came to see him. That sounds like a plan. I don't mind doing that at all. I told you, if we can work it into the schedule, Bert's from Miami, so it's very easy to get him to do stuff locally. And um, and we will rock the house. Your people are going to come out on fire, man. <laughs> that is awesome. You know, I think that there would be a really good draw with Bert and the network that you guys already have. All right. Sounds like a plan. All right, so then I will see you on Thursday. I'll have my camera team with me. And then after that, we'll sit down and we'll talk and we'll take it from there and uh, get creative together. Sounds great. I love it. All right, cool. Thanks for calling me, Ben. All right, thank you. So we actually got to go to a VIP event to meet our future clients and to meet Ben in person. So we got there and it was a nice high class event. They had some really cool different food. And the really cool thing was getting to meet some of the former dolphins who were there on display. There was Kimbo Camper, Bob Brodzinski, John Offerdahl, and then finally Sam Madison. Even if you weren't a football fan per se and you just were familiar with the sport, it was neat to get their perspective and everybody loves behind the scenes stories, which is why you're watching this show. Well, first of all, guys, a lot of excitement around South Florida and around the Miami Dolphins because training camp starts tomorrow morning bright and early. Nowadays, they're selecting these players. They want them to come in a little bit smarter, understanding uh, the things that they did in college, so they don't have to translate as much. Now you start looking around Mike Wallace and some of the Brian Hart lines and all the people they're bringing in, and they become a group that, that can be very dangerous and explosive. You have the leadership as well as the competition that haven't been around in this position in a very long time. I think about eight to ten weeks from now, I think a lot of people are going to be talking about the Dolphins. I think it's going to be a very, very, very exciting football team, and I think it'll surprise a lot of people. Some of the funnier bits were when they were talking about their former head coaches. Stories about Jimmy Johnson, which were rather entertaining. He just blew the whistle like, hey, 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 are you hurt? Are you injured? He's like, coach, I'm injured. He's like, well, you need to blend in with the damn grass. I don't need to hear your mouth. They shared a story about Don Shula, which was absolutely hilarious. When I was a rookie, I mean, rookie years are the most impressionable years. Get up in this quiet breakfast, run to the bathroom, get into the stool, and leaning right over it, and I just throw up right in the stool. The moment I do that, you don't, you don't know this story. You I hear the voice of God right next to me. Offered all. Is that you? I'm on the ground and I look down and sure enough, Coach Shula, he, he was taking a crapper right in the stall next to me. What are you going to do? Hey, Oh my god. This is going to be interesting. She wants to kiss the Super Bowl ring. You know, we got to film this. Come on, let's do it. Come on. You see this, guys? How did you feel when you won this? Man, it was awesome because I knew I helped preserve the Dolphins, the 72 undefeated Dolphins, are we not out the Patriots. We're going to make it happen with the Miami Dolphins. Ben? Yes. Hi, how are you? Alexa. Alexa, good to see you. Nice to meet you. Is that the camera? Yeah, that's one of them. The you other got, one's over here. Some serious equipment. You weren't messing around. <laughs> no. I looked at your site, so I knew that you were serious, but... Yeah, I told you. Well, when Vince, if it's an invitation from Vince, you know we're going to take it serious. So. Okay, well, that's very sweet. So, I acknowledged, I got feedback. I'll call you and we'll sit down and we'll talk in a couple Absolutely. days. All right? Sure. I just wanted to introduce myself Thank before we take much. off. All right. Thanks, Ben. Thanks, Ben. See you around. 
right now I feel like our community is not involved because we haven't had a win and that shouldn't make a difference. You shouldn't be a fan just because you're winning. You have to be a fan because you're having pride about the community that you live in. But then it's also reflected by the players that are not being involved with the community and getting to know us. Overall, it was a top-notch event put on by an absolute world-class organization, and we look forward to working with the Miami Dolphin franchise going forward. So today, we are actually heading a little bit north to an event that we've been invited to to share a little bit about our latest program called Video Forum, one of our recent video programs that teaches attendees not only about the aspect of video and creating professional videos, but also using it and integrating it in social media. Because we also get hired every now and then to do not only the training for corporations, but actually video. So we create the videos for the training for the corporation. Sharing the stage with us today at the Broward College campus was the organizer Priscilla Dames Blake. I'm a trainer, that's what I do, and I wanted to also to be able to do seminars. Also, we had Jonathan J. Dog Letterman. I am very excited to be here this morning. Easily and effortlessly. I got easily and effortlessly. Corinne Brunitz. I studied in the Inter American University. And Victoria Brinkley. We do this around the world. We're professional speakers and we have fun with it. So with that said, I'm gonna bring up Welcome to the family. I'm Val. Don't forget to like, comment, and share our video. And subscribe, of course. <laughs>